chocolates, cheesecake, candy apples, caramel popcorn, and more. Just hearing these words and you should already be on your way to the chocolate season in Algona, Iowa. With homemade goods made daily, visiting this culinary experience is a must. Let's learn more on this episode of Small Town Eats and Yummy Treats. The town of Algona wasn't prepared for the big city cuisine Erica Jensen had in her chocolate shop when she moved the online business she started in Omaha in 2007 to its eventual walk-in location on State Street of Erica's hometown in 2011. Erica never had intentions going into culinary, but after some convincing from her husband, family and friends to polish her natural baking skills, she soon started the chocolate season, a place to go and feel what she considers a very similar feeling when eating grandma's cooking. You get that feeling of just complete comfort and warmth and happiness and love. It was that kind of motivation behind giving that feeling to other people is what I really wanted to do. The chocolate season is such a relaxing and stylish atmosphere where you can come and have a chat over dessert or sip on your favorite drink while finishing up some work. It's definitely an experience you want to visit again and again. The theme behind the chocolate season is inspired from when she traveled to Europe and job shadowed at different shops. She found herself impressed with how the Europeans live their day-to-day -day lives. That feeling I got when I was there wasn't like nothing I'd ever experienced before. And it was like everybody was busy, but they didn't seem busy. Like they would stop and they'd have an espresso and a croissant, or they would stop and eat like a four piece box of chocolates and then go back to work. And I was like, that is the way to live. Like, you know, I really wanted to bring that to the Midwest. And so she did, as Erica and her family created a space that was calm, relaxing, and nothing quite like Algona had seen before. When local customers first started coming into her shop, though, Erica ran into the problem that her place and products were a little too unusual for her small community. You're having edible art. You're getting to take a little pieces of creativity home with you on a daily basis. And so that was probably the hardest part, was like getting them to understand why I was doing this. It's like, you don't go into this business to make money. You do it because you want to share a passion with somebody else. Customers were slowly trained about the quality of the chocolate season's lunches and desserts. They had had to go outside of their comfort zone and try vinegar or salt and pepper in their truffles, as they have found that it's actually quite delicious. After the first couple of years, customers have become very open to Erica's products and even proud that such an exquisite destination is in their hometown. If the name Chocolate Season doesn't already make your mouth water, then maybe one of the other lunch items will. There's lots of soups, salads, and sandwiches, and even macaroni and cheese. What about desserts? Well, the list never ends. There's lots of flavors of truffles, brownies, and more. I'm ready to start my Chocolate Season adventure right now. Chocolate Season changes their lunch menu seasonally to include great winter and summer meals and drinks. Eric and Steph are always experimenting with their confectionaries as well. With over 70 flavors of truffles and customer favorites like cheesecake brownies, one could spend an entire week trying all the different products they offer. The best part of eating at the Chocolate Season, though, is the service and interaction they provide. I think it's just the idea that we get to know our customers and that's a nice level of comfort and security. We have a fudge downstairs. And it's just fudge, but um, they requested the flavor combination and so we named it after them, Fun Mark Fudge. People get to be interactive with the store and with the products. If people have requests, we're happy to do that for them. The chocolate season is such a unique eatery that there are very few places like it. If you're looking to satisfy your sweet tooth or an excellent cup of coffee, this is the place to be. I'm gonna sink my teeth into one of their delicious turkey cranberry sandwiches, but you definitely need to come and try it for yourself.